Welcome back guys to We Talk Boxing and this is my post fight review for the fight which took place last night between Munguia versus John Ryder. Now this was a good fight, um, I'm not sure if any of you guys have watched it, it was on like, early hours in the UK, um, but it was a good fight for Munguia. He took on John Ryder and John Ryder not long ago went the distance with Canelo Alvarez. However, this time, um, sorry, John John Ryder came up short, um, and he got stopped. He got he got stopped in the ninth round. So again, it was a a tough, tough fight for John Ryder, and um, he was put down a few times as well with, within the fight. Um, it just goes to show how big of a puncher Mungia is. Quite a devastating puncher. Um, I felt John Ryder had a, a good couple of rounds within the fight. Uh, from what I remember, I think it was round six and seven. I think um, these were the only rounds that Ryder Ryder won. Um, I'm sure it was six and seven, but these. But anyhow, Ryder only won two rounds for, throughout the fight. Um, the, for the rest of the fight, it it was pretty much one way traffic. And as I mentioned, um, Ryder had to get up a couple of times off the floor, and even from round one, it was pretty much just a matter of time because when you were looking at the size difference between both of these guys, there was a clear difference. Munguia looked a, a, a different weight in there. He looked like he was, you know what I mean, um, a middleweight like, or a light heavyweight. Do you know what I mean? Not middleweight, light heavyweight compared to um, John Ryder. But it is what it is. Um, I feel as if that could maybe be it now for John Ryder. Don't see him maybe uh, probably stepping in the ring again. There are a couple of fights out there for him. It's just whether or not he obviously wants to maybe drop back down. You know what I mean? And maybe try and have a few domestic fights because he's, he's lost now. Every time he's pretty much stepped up, you know what I mean, to that world elite level, he's lost. Um, and it's such a shame because he's a decent fighter. It's just in this fight, it, it, it was just too small. Mungia looked brilliant at distance. You know what I mean? Every time he kept um, John Ryder at distance, you know what I mean? It, it was in my mind, it was like a matter of time because like his, his shots, the shots that he was landing on Ryder were, were, were brilliant. And as I mentioned, you know what I mean? From my perspective, Ryder only had two good rounds in in, in the nine rounds, and he, those rounds that he had were the rounds where he was like he managed to break the distance between him and Munguia. He closed that distance, and obviously he was sticking it on him and making the fight a little bit rugged for Munguia. Um, and the only other round that he won was where Munguia took a round off, and then he obviously punished him the following round. So yeah, it was one of them. Good performance from Munguia. Love to see who he goes up against next. There was talk about obviously the Canelo fight. Can't see <laughs> Canelo wanting that fight because I think that'll be a quite um, a tough, a very tough fight for Canelo Alvarez. I'm a big Canelo Alvarez fan, but I think Munguia it will ask him some big, big questions and whether or not he's still got that in him. Uh, Canelo Alvarez to maybe answer those questions, but it's it's a tricky one because if Canelo doesn't fight Munguia, he has to fight Bene Benavides, and both guys, do you know what I mean? Look devastated at the minute. You know what I mean? Two two tough Mexicans, um, and obviously Canelo's gone on record a few times as saying that he doesn't really want to fight another Mexican. What Canelo may probably do is probably say, look, you two fight, you know what I mean, each other. The winner our fight he could do that you never know but anyway guys let me know your thoughts in regards to this fight um was it what you expected did you did you maybe think john Ryder was going to cause an upset would you like to see john Ryder continue in the sport and if so who against and who would you like to see mongear go up against next as always guys let me know your thoughts in the comments below bless